Well, lunch is going to look a little different for students in Howard County. That's right, the school district changing up the menus to offer healthier food now. Yeah, Dennis Valera is your community reporter in Howard County, and he tells us how this is the result of community partnerships. When it comes to school lunches, some Howard County students say it could be better. Amir Idris just graduated from Reservoir High School. And with my time in high school, you know, I didn't have the best, the best school lunches. And a lot of people that I knew who didn't have lunch from home, they wouldn't eat uh, the school lunches. It's why Howard County Public School System leaders, along with community organizations, announced a new initiative Thursday. Starting this coming school year, breakfast and lunches will be locally sourced. The work on this started a year ago after a survey was conducted by the Horizon Foundation's Healthier Choices Coalition. About 244 out of the 370 folks who responded, we heard mostly that people were looking for healthier, fresher, and tastier food. When shown the survey, the school district was on board. School systems are community systems. We can only do great work when we work together. The challenges of hunger, food insecurity are greater than just any school system. The school district says they're still determining exactly what will be on the new menus and served in cafeterias. Part of it is because they are still working to determine exactly where the food will be coming from. Students and their families also will have a say through taste testings that are planned. A goal with these new menus is to also tackle food insecurity. In Howard County, the number of students who only eat school meals has gone up over the years. When I came here 10 years ago, that percentage was like 16%. Unfortunately, now we're close to 31%. Idris and other students have been working to make these foods more accessible with the Lindemann Foundation, a local nonprofit, for years. He says these new menus take their work to another level. It's really great to see all the hard work coming up and successfully. The aim is to have the new menus established by September or October. Reporting on your corner in Jessup, I'm Dennis Valera for WJZ. All right, Dennis, thank you. And look, if you have a news tip in Howard County, reach out to Dennis Valera. Send him an email to newsroom at WJZ.com.